Hey guys, Dr. Mike Isertel here for Renaissance Periodization and Juggernaut Training Systems. I'm going to talk about a huge myth, the myth of cleanses and detoxes. Kind of a good news, bad news sort of situation. First off, unless you're eating industrial waste or opening up batteries and sucking out the, the contents there, you have a very low risk of any kind of severe chemical buildup. So this idea that we absorb all of these toxins from our environment on our normal foods that we eat and they're slowly killing us doesn't have a ton of merit to it. It has some merit. We do have that going on to some extent, but the issue is with number two here, to the extent that that buildup does occur, drinking special drinks and weird concoctions that cost an exorbitant amount of money, they don't actually clean you out. There is really no such thing. Right? You don't clean out a laptop computer by pouring water all over it. The body is an unbelievably complex system. Just drinking a bunch of extra stuff doesn't clean out, perhaps, the chemicals that are stored up in your fat stores. It just doesn't work like that. However, we do have incredibly powerful internal systems for detoxifying, in some sense, various body systems and the body as a whole. Your liver and your kidneys they're the real go-to mechanisms for that, and they do a really, really good job at it, especially when they're supported by some things you do on your end. What kind of things support proper detoxification of body systems via liver and kidneys? Well, a balanced diet on your end. Eating good, healthy foods most of the time absolutely supports detoxification processes. Getting regular exercise is a very potent supporter of making sure those organ systems are working well and working at capacity. And lastly, making sure to be properly hydrated. That doesn't mean drinking any kind of weird mixes of juices and waters at crazy levels. Just making sure that you're regularly drinking water and your urine color is relatively uh, clear or off yellow and your urine amount is voluminous, right? So just staying properly hydrated, getting regular exercise, eating a good, healthy, balanced diet is the best way you can support this detoxification process that's primarily executed by your liver and your kidneys. Here's the deal. There is no quick fix. Cleanses and detoxes all work on one underlying principle that's false. That you can eat like total crap, smoke a bunch of cigarettes, have a ton of beer all the time, really sort of dirty up your body for lack of a better word, even though it's really not what's happening, more or less degrade your health, and then through some magical weird fix of drinking some concoctions, you can take it back to square one, clean everything out, and be good to go. It doesn't work like that. I kind of wish it did. That would be really cool. We could all live these totally irresponsible lives and then come back and do a detox every now and again and be crystal clear, right? It, it, it's not how it works. In reality, how it works is this. You want to be healthy, you have to live a healthy lifestyle. Does that mean you can have a couple of beers every now and again or, or do whatever unhealthy other habits you have? Totally, but most of your life should be dedicated to having a good eating pattern, eating relatively healthy, getting regular exercise, being properly hydrated. That's what makes you healthy. That's what makes sure that toxin levels of various sorts don't accumulate to a crazy amount. That's the way to good health not through detoxes and cleanses. Those are pretty much money-making scams, as far as we can tell. They don't do what's intended, and they really give you this illusion that you can have a really unhealthy lifestyle and make up for it somehow. Focus on living your life well and healthy most of the time. That's your best bet for staying healthy. Thanks so much for tuning in. Dr. Mike Isertelier for Renaissance Periodization and Juggernaut Training Systems. As a PhD of sport physiology, a professor of nutrition, and the head science consultant for Renaissance Periodization, it was very important for me to be part of the design process of a supplement that I could really support, not only with the fact that it would be effective in the real world, but that it would be scientifically valid. When I helped as the main designer for the ingredients of Grind Supplements, we made sure that all the supplements had only research-backed ingredients that definitely worked or definitely worth your money. There's no magic, there's no gimmicks, there's no bunk. I'm Dr. Mike Isertel, and I'm on my grind.